We proved the chain rule for logarithm in the last video, which was log base A of B times log base B of C was equal to log base A of C. And if you want to see a proof, uh, you may see some I popping up right here. You can click on it and you can go to the video where I present the proof of this. And this thing is called the chain rule for logarithms. And I thought it may be fun to present you with a with a fun little question I just made up. And it's log base 2 of 3 times log base 3 of 4 times log base 4 of 5 times log base 5 of 6 all the way to times log base 15 of 16. And you want to find the value of this. And I encourage you to pause the video right now and try to find this. Now, uh, hopefully, maybe you paused the video and you found the solution and maybe maybe you came close but you did not. So let's try to find it ourselves. The chain rule for logarithms tell you that this b and this b cancel out and you can simplify this to log base a of c. And that's what we're going to do. This 3 and this 3 cancel out. These 4s cancel out. 5s cancel out. 6s cancel out. All the way to 15s canceling out. So all we have, all we have left is log base 2 of 16, which is equal to 4, because 2 to the 4th power is 16. So that's it. 